Stretch Knox. You're listening to Session with the Band. And this is WZMB 91.3 FM Greenville's student radio station. So uh, we kind of talked about your other projects, but um, we wanted to t- maybe talk about your uh, upcoming thing going with this guy from Serbia, X3M. Uh, X3M was is a producer who hit me up through MySpace, um, you know, which you get quite often these days. And uh, he, had, he had actually told me that he had heard my music on the internet somehow, I, I don't even know. Like I said, he's from Serbia. Um, so whatever, he, he said it was on some hip hop radio station, so. Um, cool, so yeah. He yeah, it, it's just crazy the kind of effect that you know, that, that, that or the impact that, you know, the this world, this internet uh, just has on like the world of music, I guess you could say, you know, it's just everywhere and you don't even know it. But anyways, he hit me up and he wanted me on his mixtape. So we did the song Frontline, which was on the self-portrait and, uh, and actually on his mixtape, which is super dope. I, like, I, 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 can, I cannot put in words how awesome his mixtape is. He, he has um, hip-hop artists, R&B artists from all over the world on it. And it's, I mean, it's, it's just crazy. It's for free on the internet. So, you know, go to my MySpace page, go to his, and you can download it. But anyways, he hit me up. And um, I'm kind of on this new kick now, man, where, you know, I, like, like I said before, as far as the industry goes and as far as music goes, I mean, it's not as profitable as it once was, um, you know. And not to say that, you know, necessarily music should be made for the for the sake of, you know, making a profit. But, you know, if you know, people are spending money and people are doing things, and that's just that's just the art of business. So, um, anyways, man, I I just I'm gonna start doing EPs with people. After this album, I do a stretch. I I don't think I'm gonna do another full length album for a long time, um, if ever. I guess really. Um, I'm just gonna work with different producers and I'm gonna do EPs. Um, like I said, I got the EP with DJ FM, I got the EP with X3M, um, that's gonna be out later this summer. And then after that, I've already uh, been in talks, I'm working with this uh, dope producer, LL, uh, out of Wilmington, and we're, we've already started working on this next one. And uh, also this um, cool electronic group from around here called the LPs, I think I'm gonna do something right, short yeah, and quick with them. So yeah, man, and then me, and then also at the same time, me and Stretch will be back working on our next e- project, which will be an EP. So cool. So we got. So I know you collaborate with a lot of artists around here, or uh, maybe out in Raleigh. What's 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 some of the what's some other bands or artists you kind of um, going on stage with? Well, yeah, you know, you can always catch me pretty much at uh, a lot of Blunt Harvey shows. Um, yeah. I've, I've been, you know, performing and doing stuff with them since back when they were Ill Clinton, and and you know, like even just in their, uh, you know, the the first. Like I guess stages, anyways. But yeah, so Blunt Harvey, you know, is always a pleasure to work with. Um, as far as doing shows and stuff, man. Superstition, Kazi, uh, Joe Scudder, a lot of the Justice League cats, man. They're all good people, man. You know, um, I mean, they're really just a short length away. You, you know, you kind of run into those dudes a lot. So um, Legacy, um, Nicolay. Uh, you know, then I got my people like Fuzz Jacks out of Wilmington. I love doing shows with my people Mons One out of Wilmington. Um, you know, it's it's just like there's there's a really dope hip hop community in North Carolina that really like respects like hip hop for what it is. Yeah. Um, you know, and it, it's it's just crazy. And I, I hope like some of us, all of us, any of us, you know, can can find our way to get heard by the masses. And yeah, outside of the I mean, state, it, se- so. it seems like uh, people aren't are all about the money and the fame and the flashy lights and everything, and just putting out good music. That's uh, that's what hip hop's supposed to be. Yeah, 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 yeah. And it's it's like I said, it's crazy. You would think a state that's borderline southern, um, you would find a lot of BS as far as the music goes, and as far as just the you know this bubblegum, uh, ringtone rap. I mean, which you can still find that anywhere, but. Um, there's just so much dope underground hip hop here, man. It's crazy. All right, well, cool. We'll get right back into another song, and uh, this one's um, also off the Stretch Knox investment yeah, what, album. Yeah, what up, Stretch? Come on, man. What's good, man? Let's get this Stretch. I got a second. cold, man. I'm sick, he man. He got a cold. He got a. Cold. I don't want to, you know, I don't want to spread my germs over the airways and all Stretch, that. Stretch, what up? What up with some some beats? Why don't you tell people how to get up with you or something? Stretch got the fire beats, man. He got he. He got the swing. He got his drums. Got the swing. Yeah, you know I got to keep that swing on my drums. <laughs> <laughs> nah, but for real, man, tell me your MySpace page. Or something. Um, you can check me out. My record company label slash whatever you want to call it is Fine Tune Productions. It's P F I N E T U N E S. So you can check that out. Um, Fine Tunes at MySpace dot com. Yeah, yeah. For right now. Yeah, yeah. And check out my website, man. I'm gonna have my website. Uh, up and running probably in the next month is whoisbighop.com so make sure you check for that you can go up there and you can actually um, 
check out some beats. I got I got a bunch of beats from Trigger and I got a bunch of beats from Stretch up there. You can actually lease them through my website and stuff. Um, so hit us up. We'll you know we'll break you off a deal. We're gonna keep putting beats up there all, all the time. So you know maybe my man Lamont Cole over here. Maybe we'll try to get him some work and try to get some of his beats up there. Yes, sir. Yeah. All right. There you go. So hustle is what's up. Tell me a little bit about Hustle Is is another song off our album. It actually features a uh, very talented, talented uh, ECU student, Raven B. She's singing the hook on it. Um, shout outs to Raven. What up? What up? What's good, up. Raven? But yeah, um, she's singing the hook. This is, uh, you know, this is funny because when Stretch was making, when we were making our album and stuff, he, you know, he he told me like he's like this, this is like my favorite beat. Man. <laughs> and you know, like with a producer, he, he you know he tells you this is his favorite beat. Like you you know you really. You really got to impress him, you know, because I, I mean, I'm sure there's a lot of time stressless in there. And I mean, he's he's spent countless hours recording me and I'm sure like half the time he's like beating, beating himself over the head because, you know, I mean, whatever, whatever, whatever. <laughs> right. But, you know, like I, I just really wanted to uh, make the song special, you know, um, and just make it like, I don't know, I guess memorable for all of us and especially for the album. Because, it's classic, you know, man. It goes well with, uh, you know, the, the whole theme of the investment. So, um, like I said, this track is called Hustle Is. You know, check it out, man. The investment. When's the investment coming out, Stretch? I don't know when the investment <laughs> is coming out. <laughs> Maybe when the investment pays off. How about that? Right on. All right. Cool. So, yeah, that was. All right, man. We're moving right along. Get on.